Hollers from Kyrgyzstan goalkeeper Pavel Matyash saw China come back from a goal down to prevail 2-1 on Monday Kyrgyzstan's goalkeeper Matyash Pavel punches across onto his own crossbar, with the ball rebounding off him, to give China their equalizer. EPA China's midfielder Zhang Chengdong fights for the ball with Kyrgyzstan's forward Mirlin Muirzaev. AFP Jowsery heads the ball away for China. EPA China's defender Yu Dibao his winning goal. AP photo Kyrgyzstan's goalkeeper Matyash clears the ball under pressure from Wu Lei. AP photo China's midfielder Zhang Wokai and forward Xiao Ji fight for the ball with Kyrgyzstan's midfielder Farhad Muzabekov. AFP players from both sides scrap for the ball. AFP China's players celebrate after scoring their equalizer. AFP Kyrgyzstan's midfielder Akhlad and Israelov, Lev, and China's defender Wu Shi fight for the ball. AP photo Kyrgyzstan's players celebrate taking the lead. AFP Kyrgyzstan's Muirzaev Mirlin gets a header away. EPA China manager Marcelo Lippi on the sidelines. AP photo Kyrgyzstan's players celebrate with their fans after scoring the first goal. EPA China's Kai Zhangguo, right, watches on as Sajin Bayev Bikjan falls over. EPA Kyrgyzstan's midfielder Farhad Muzabekov tussles for the ball with China's midfielder Jing Daojin. AFP Yu Dibao slots the ball into an empty net for China to take the lead. EPA China manager Marcelo Lippi has questioned the attitude of his players after they needed two goalkeeping errors to stage a comeback win against Kyrgyzstan in their Asian Cup opener. Kyrgyzstan goalkeeper Pavel Matyash inexplicably palmed the ball into his own net for China's equalizer just after halftime before a rush of blood 12 minutes from time saw him come herring out to the edge of his area before being rounded by Beijing Guo and forward Yu Dibao to score into an empty net. With South Korea winning 1-0 against a defiant Philippines, who like Kyrgyzstan are tournament debutants, with a goal by Wang Uijo, the East Asian nations are the Group C pace setters. But Lippi, who guided Italy to World Cup glory in 2006, was far from happy with China's performance, particularly in the opening 45 minutes, in Alain on Monday. I've been in China for two years now and it's not the first time we've been in this situation, Lippi said of his side's disjointed display. There were a few times when the team couldn't play well in the first half and then, after I got angry and I pushed my players, I got the reaction I wanted from the first minute. Maybe it's the characteristics of the players from China, blank, read more, China 2-2-1 Kyrgyzstan, Yu Dibao the hero as China fight back to beat Kyrgyzstan Iran 5-0 Yemen, Jan Koshin says Yemen must move on from Iran Asian Cup drubbing and focus on next games Milovan Rajabek sacked by Thailand following 4-1 Asian Cup defeat. To India, blank, China, whose previous best performances at the quadrennial championship or two runner-up finishes, in 1984 and 2004, were outplayed in the first half by the Central Asian side and it came as little surprise when Auckland and Israelov put Kyrgyzstan in front three minutes before the break with a superb volley. Matyash's horrendous mistake, however, gifted the Chinese an equalizer five minutes after the restart when he palmed a seemingly harmless looping header from Jiang Linpeng into his own goal under no pressure. The goal lifted the Chinese and Matyash was again at fault when he came charging but missed both man and ball as Yu slotted home late on to give Lippi's team a winning start in the group. Kyrgyzstan manager Alexander Krestinen refused to blame his goalkeeper and said his team would keep fighting, with games against South Korea and the Philippines to come. We're not talking about the mistake from one person, it was the whole team that lost the game, he said. We missed chances in the first half, but this is how the game is at big tournaments and we know that, updated, January 8, 2019, 10.22 a.m.